Hello once again, audience. Oh, man. You know how food is delicious sometimes or sometimes it just tastes eh? And you don't want to eat that stuff that tastes eh? You know? Part of me thinks maybe it tastes eh because you're not supposed to eat it. But uh, a lot of people would say, no, you're supposed to eat this stuff that tastes eh to me. Why? Why is it taste ah? Because it's healthy. That's what healthy is. <laughs> you sound crazy. <laughs> I mean, it makes sense, I guess. But uh, it doesn't make sense. I don't like it. But water is the best. You know, water's really good. It's delicious. But I love drinking stuff that tastes delicious more. Don't you? Yeah. Um, anyways, <clears throat> I've had a wonderful day so far. I uh, ate a delicious burrito. This, this burrito, let me just tell you a little bit about how delicious it is. And uh, I don't even know exactly what's in it. This is like some meat, potatoes, and stuff, and whatever. But it also comes with, get this, a whole salad with cashews and strawberry. Oh, man, it was delicious. I was like, mmm, it's only $8.50. It's way too little for a big salad and a burrito. Absolutely legit. And they're wondering why they're not turning much of a profit. <laughs> Asians. They're Asian, I don't know, I don't know. It's not funny, what are you laughing? What are you laughing? I'm not laughing at that, I was thinking of something else. There's nothing to do with that, what's wrong with you? I love Asians, they're great. I mean, I love, uh, you know, I love everybody, I love people, but uh, it's just pointing out specifically that they come from Asia, makes them exotic, makes them exotic and they have accents, that's fun. I don't know what it is, we love accents, don't you? My favorite is uh, mine. But second favorite, distant second, uh, Australian's pretty good. And then uh, way after that, I'm just kidding. You know, I, I really love, uh, I love all the accents. British is fun. You know, I really love British. Australian's fun. Whoa, Lamborghini. Wee! You lost me. Middle of my sentence. What was I talking? I mean, French is, is fun, but I haven't really met someone that speaks French and had to listen to them a long period of time. You know what I mean? Italian's amazing because Sopranos stuff. Australian's amazing because that accent means you can handle any anything in nature that's trying to kill you, mate. I can take that. Darn on me. Or you go to mouse. It's not even it's not even dangerous, or I'll take the mouse. What's that? A crocodile. Five hundred pound crocodile. Is that all? Eh, it's not a croc. This is a croc. It's only been two minutes and 50 seconds so far. Guys, we got way more time. To, all, right, all right, so <clears throat> going to lunch today uh, at this other place. My point was, I don't want to eat. I want to, I want to eat healthier because diet is supposed to be 90% of the whole situation, you know, of your whole getting healthy situation. And then there's the working out part. So I've just really been doing the working out because it's like, ah, I don't, I love the strength training. Have you been, have you been strength, strength training? Do it. Maybe one day we'll do like an inside the gym uh, vlog, but eh, you know, not a lot of people that would take kindly to people recording videos in the gym here. They're like, what is that? That man is aiming at little block of glass at us. We're like, stop aiming that block of glass. <laughs> like you people don't know what these are still. They do, it's very, honestly, that's a bit ageist, honestly. Just because the person's 105, the guy running for shit for office here is, is 90. The guy that, yeah, and he's a, you know, I don't know. He's probably gonna win. <laughs> he's 90. You're like, like how, she needs somebody to help him, like do stuff. I mean, I don't know. Okay, pe maybe people live a long time. Good for him, by the way. That's a good, solid age. It just seems like, don't you not want to do? politics at that age or is it that fun or is it that important okay those are the honest options because there is the option that it's so important and you have a lot of grandkids and let's say they're stupid and you really want to make their world better and so then there's also the argument well hold on young people think differently than old people and you're like oh yeah 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 old people want to do the you know old-fashioned stuff new people want to play with each other's buttholes um, yeah, I don't know. It's, uh, I, I get it. I get it. I get that. <laughs> well, how have you been? So we've been posting vlogs every day for a, a while now. 
and I'm getting to the point to where I need to need to spice it up. I need to start stepping outside of the uh, the old comfort zone. I like this car. I like this vehicle, but uh, I need to start doing something. You know, I loved going to bowling, bowling the other day, but you know that's how you get things to talk about. Not only, but it's how you get experiences in your life. It's how you have a swath of things to talk about. Let's say if you're trying to attract a mate, if you go to the club and you haven't even been to dance town. Well, then what, how are you gonna expect to? How are you gonna expect to, to you know, draw the eye of a, of a nice lady? But when you're standing next to this guy who freaking went to swing swing zone last week or hip hop class, I'm just saying it's not easy, okay? It's not supposed to be easy, but. You know, it is. Just you have to be consistent, now, guys. I'm giving you real lessons here. Can you please stop rolling your eyes? <sighs> I'm telling you, I'm telling you. Go to church or start a church, or get a social club. Meet every week. Find you got to find a social club of people of all ages where somebody tells them, "Hey, everything's fine. You're loved. We're loved. It's all working together in harmony. Can we? Everybody, go. We're gonna have a good week." Start something like that or go to church, any church. I'm telling you. And then tell me about it. <laughs> uh, it's been really fun. <clears throat> what a funny time to be alive. There's so many freaking social medias. I posted on Truth, Truth Social the other day. All right, let's see. I'll post something. And it sounds like it'll be right up these people's alley. Nothing. No interactions at all. So, clearly I was uh, canceled on there already. You bastard! All right. Uh, hey, Arby's. Check it out. Beautiful. Okay, so, yeah. Snapchat is cool for, I used to record stuff inside Snapchat, like videos that I would post here or elsewhere. But recently, I found out TikTok has a freaking coolest uh, filter. If you want to look attractive, okay, you push that vlog filter. That's all you need to do. Um, and then, you know, drag the scroller down a little bit so nobody knows. You don't want anybody to know. I miss the days when phones made you look like you were 25. But you, that's because you were 25. Shut up! Dang it! That's a true fact if I ever heard one. <laughs> I hope that one day we live to see YouTube still exists and some kid in the future is gonna be like looking at like nugget in a biscuit and it'll be like, 115 years ago. <laughs> Nugget in a biscuit. Ah, oh, that's all I want, really. I want to, you know, I just want to glance into the future so I can see which social media platform to keep my, uh, my stuff at. You might say every one of them. Let's say YouTube gets shut down one day. You know, it happens. Businesses, they do that. Let's say another business starts up. There's no way... YouTube is gonna copy the videos. There's no way the new company is gonna copy the videos to this new platform, right? And if they do, they're not gonna prioritize mine. They're gonna prioritize kids playing with Legos or whatever. Yeah? They're not gonna be like, we must preserve Tobaskis music from the early 2010s. We must make sure to not lose the literal trailers or the parody songs of the time of the age. Parody said you only get if you also listen to the song. It was parodying. Tobotskis will be forever restored on the internet. Man. You ever watch Riddick with that Vin Diesel fella? That's an interesting future. No computers. Everybody stands like this. And they all have like dresses on. And they look undead. And they are undead. Necronomicon. Whatever they're called. Necromongers. <laughs> There's another one. That's another movie. That's Army of Darkness. Bruce Campbell is a pimp. All right, guys, I'm going to go. Thanks for watching this video. It's been really fun. Didn't really uh, necessarily say anything, but I feel good. I feel very good in this desert. Um, in Florida, I remember I had very bad allergies. I have pretty much no allergies now, which is a very strange. I have a little bit of allergies, but very, 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 very little. And we're right in the summer, too, so it's like this is maximum exposure, baby. Um, I like it. And uh, maybe I'll stop by Los Angeles again in a month. 
and uh, see how it feels. See if it feels crazy. Might feel a little bit too crazy, you know. Uh, I love it over there, but in the bubble I live in, it seems like they're a bit cray cray. And they always have been, and hey, that's fine. That's where the creatives are. Yeah, nobody's nobody's against the idea that open-mindedness is a good thing. There's also closed-mindedness, which is a bad thing sometimes. Not always. Not when it's like, well, let's make sure we don't uh, we don't get rid of baby powder. I'm 90. I'm running for office. Let's stock up on baby powder instead of juice we just invented to put in the babies through not their mouths. How about we do that? <laughs> What's going on? All right, sorry, it's a bit too long again. Bless your face. Outro of darkness and redness. Take care of yourself. Take a shower. Come on. Just a little bit. Don't waste too much water. You gotta save that for me. I need a big bunch of showers. Constant. One time, oh man. I hope we figure out this water problem. How embarrassing would it be to die of uh, of uh, thirst on a planet that is blue because it's made out of water? How sad would that be? Oh, we live in abundance. We're like, but can we just drink the rain? No, not allowed to drink the rain. You got to get the bottled water. But it, but it's falling into my mouth. Ah, ah, ah. All right, bless your face.